But it's funny, isn't it? We, we, we try to transition to, to the future. You know, we mm. got we got as far ahead as the war in uh, yeah. in uh, Ukraine, and we went all the way back to the Second World War again. <laughs> we, we, because we we really we really didn't escape, and this is just like psychology. It's all trauma. Yeah, we're still living in our You're past. Right. We're yeah. like a, we're the it's nation. Collective trauma, isn't it's a it? Collective trauma. Yeah. We never got over it. We ne- We all have these. How would we get over it collectively? Is there is there something we can do uh, consciously, or yes. would it be a catalyst in in, uh, in events that would cause something like that? Well, bringing it back to Uber Boyo and Nietzsche, I think like the the emphasis from what I understood from where from where he wasn't really talking to me, he was talking to a panel. You've got slave morality and you've got master morality. Master morality, everybody says there's no there's no Nietzsche's not saying one's better than the other. I'm like. Mm. I'm not sure about that. It's pretty clear where the problems of slave morality are. Master morality could become sadistic and dominating and awful. But slave morality makes a virtue of being a victim. Mm -hmm. No, not anymore. Guys, come on. We've run this experiment for decades. It's fucking awful. But wouldn't you say that at the moment being a victim is profitable? A hundred percent. Yeah. So Which while it's, while, peop- while people are making money collectively and yeah. from an ideological perspective from yeah. being victims, that's never going to go away, is it? So so what you've done is you've said you've said collectively, isn't it beneficial? Yes. We have so many weak people now yeah. that they all want to hide in a collective and they want to be rewarded from the top down for they, being weak. <laughs> for being weak, they want mummy and daddy to give them reparations or or rewards or something. This is. I hate this. Yeah. It's unadulterated weakness. It corrupts everyone. Totally. It corrupts the recipient. It, re- it corrupts the transmitter. And the, the, our whole environment is corrupted in that. We must move back to something. We must reject the slave morality and go back to a master morality mode. Mm. We could do that consciously, but we won't. And I think, again, it's kind of a Nietzschean, maybe Jungian idea. Uh, we have we the people. We, what is we the people? That's the mass of people who want to move in a certain direction. Where are they going? Can we stop them? Mm. No. So I'm pessimistic. No. Why do we have racism? Because people like racism. Mm. Why do we have this absurd narrative around the war in Ukraine? Because that's what people want. They're jerking themselves off on Instagram and Facebook, pretending to be something that they're not. They don't realize the damage they're doing. They have no idea how much damage they're doing when when they, when they spin the narrative in a certain way. Let me be clear, I'm not for the invasion of Ukraine. My God, I think it's barbaric. Yeah. It's, it's totally unacceptable. Nations are sovereign. It's none of our business though, really, is it? Which was the point I was gonna make earlier. Yeah. Ukraine has its own problems. Has it been working balls out since the year 2000 yeah. to now to resolve its own shit? No. Mm-hmm. What's it been doing? Stealing from the fucking people. Mm. Tell me I'm lying. Uh. It's utterly fucking corrupt. I just come from Serbia. It's one of the most ago. corrupt nations on earth. Right. We're told that you know, we've got a, a cost of living crisis in this country, yet yeah. we're sending billions to yeah. Ukraine. Yeah. Why? Yes. <laughs> so, so, so what I would say is this is back to the sort of the ma- when, we, when in Nietzsche, master morality and slave morality. Yeah. Nietzsche used the term morality. It probably would be better translated as a philosophy. Okay. Do you have a master philosophy or a slave philosophy? We're operating from a slave philosophy. This is a lack of a good philosophy. We should, ha- we should be way more decisive than this. Mm. We should be much, much stronger than this and say, no, here are our boundaries. This is what we will help you with. This is what we won't help you with. This is what we have an agreement for, what we don't have an agreement for. Everything is so wet and weak and wishy-washy from the top down. There's no adults in